the minimal squared luxury look on a budget. Challenge accepted. In this video, I'll walk you through how to build a timeless wardrobe with just a few items. This video is brought to you by Les Trench. More on them later. If you're into fashion and style, you may have heard about the all money aesthetic, stealth wealth, quiet luxury, fashion trends getting a lot of attention. From TV shows like Succession to billionaires with low key outfits to draw less attention, and movie stars embracing the monochrome look. Muted colors, elegant, luxurious, yet understated. Components of good style, the timeless look, as opposed to logo mania. What's interesting about these trends is they come and go, and what's trendy today may be tacky in a couple of years. However, the minimalist look remains relevant. Sometimes the best way to look good is to just stick to the basics and keep it simple. While I don't wear incredibly expensive clothes like Jeremy, I have been dressing with a minimalist aesthetic for years now. The reason I do it is because a minimalist capsule wardrobe takes me from Monday to Sunday with minimal effort in style. Now, I am all for simplicity, but I am also an artist drawn to visuals with character, and I happen to have an interest in fashion as well. Good looking clothes. Therefore, the uniform concept is not for me. Sorry, Steve. I lean more towards different neutral colors, versatile pieces of clothing that go well with any setting and I can wear in any season. The essentials, if you will. Before we go any further, I want to take a few seconds to thank the sponsor of today's video, Less Trench an impact-conscious menswear brand on a mission to create the finest essentials for life, striking the balance between subtle and beautiful. I really like the strangest trousers because they are classy, elegant, and go well with informal settings as well. Perfect for every occasion, and they come with this elastic waistband that makes them extremely comfortable to wear. If you are into the minimalist look like I am, and you want to try their awesome collection of clothes, you can use my special code for a great discount. I'll leave a link in the video description with all the information. I started wearing higher quality and better clothing this year because I am doing better financially. Hell yeah! But I also realized that I was changing my wardrobe every two to four months. I used to be an H&M guy, which is not good for the planet, because these clothes are designed to wear for a short season and dispose. In the long run, I was spending close to the same or even more on clothing, making my life more complicated because changing your wardrobe that frequently is kind of a pain in the ass. So experimenting with better garments that I can wear over and over for longer periods is a wiser decision for me in terms of both money and time, plus they look and feel way better. What we're trying to do here is build a set of clothes or sets of clothes you are comfortable with, work well together and move seamlessly between any setting and any season. To do that, we need the foundational pieces of a wardrobe, starting with a basic t-shirt. A basic t-shirt that fits your body type. Go for one that's not too tight, not too loose, just the right size. You will always need a t-shirt in your wardrobe. You can use them with any type of pants, tucked in or out. Muted colors work best, because they go well with pretty much anything. If you're only gonna go for one color, which I don't recommend, but if you want, go for black. It'll make you look leaner, and black always makes an elegant and sophisticated look without trying too hard. Second item, chinos. If I could only wear one style of pants, it'd be chinos, because they're stylish and work in casual settings as well. It is the most versatile piece of clothing you can get for your wardrobe. You can dress it up or down to go from running an errand to a work meeting or a date. It's the building block of a capsule wardrobe. The more colors, the more options, but remember to stick to neutral colors for ease of setting. It seems like baggies are back, but no, don't, not for me. Maybe it's because I've been wearing this type of pants for a long time, but I don't know. What do you think? Are baggies cool? Am I crazy? Next item, shirts. Shirts are important for work, for when you need to look smart or have a special event. Make sure to add a white shirt to your mix. They're good for summertime, but also for the extra neat look. And if you want to look like a dapper dude, the Cuban style color, an old classic for your summer trips. A great tailor blazer is a staple for your wardrobe, essential to complement your shirts for formal settings. And for colder weather, a nice quarter zip instead of the hoodie. I used to be a big fan of the hoodie and then I grew up. I'm pretty sure a lot of people are gonna hate on me for this, but as a man, you need to dress your age. If you are 40 years old, you shouldn't be wearing hoodies. I'm kidding, I'm not kidding. Next item on the list, shorts for your summer holiday. Nothing fancy, just black everyday shorts. 
I like black shoes because again, they go well with anything. You can get a pair of Oxfords if you want to look extra fancy or Chelsea's for a pretty cool look. I like these derbies that look like Martins but are not Martins. Now, socks or no socks? If it's warm, no socks looks good in my opinion. The right accessories. You should invest in a classy watch. I like this one from North Green because it's black, matte finish, classy, elegant, but not over the top. And it's pretty affordable. But if you're on a tight budget, Casio Vintage never fails. If you use glasses, a transparent frame is a nice addition to your outfit. And last but not least, caps. I had to do it. I wanted to look like Jeremy. Do I look like Jeremy? I also have a baseball cap that I'm starting to wear less because everybody out there seems to like it a lot. And that's it. After getting your essentials, you can play with them, different outfits, color combinations, dress up or down and just have fun with your clothes. Don't forget to use my promo code when shopping less strange clothing for a great discount on your essentials. That's it for this one, my friend. Thank you so much for watching. I appreciate the support. If you like the video, give it a like, subscribe for more and I'll catch you in the next one. Goodbye.